and uh, look into the Telegraph. Toppling statues. The headline is human rights is no excuse uh, for toppling statues. Explain to us what's happened. Well, you'll remember in Bristol, the statue of Edward Colston, the slave trader, um, was toppled by protesters after the Black Lives Matter movement really kicked in. And they four men protagonists were taken to court and were acquitted of um, criminal damage and their defence was the human rights, that human rights had been violated and it was a justifiable action. And um, the new um, gen uh, Attorney General Suella Braveman said, I'm worried about this because it sets a precedent for people to use violent behaviour and commit criminal damage and use human rights as a defence. And included in that would be people who glue themselves to the M25 and disrupt our lives with um, violent, disruptive protests. So she asked the Court of Appeal to look into the Colston statue incident and three of um, the top lawyers in Britain have ruled that it's not that... that it, it's not a defence to say your human rights were violated by the presence of a statue, therefore you can destroy it. So um, now then, uh, if you cause damage less than £5,000 in value, you, you'll go to a magistrate's court um, and it's you know, slightly different. It's, in that case, it's to do with the, the proportionality of the conviction depends on how much material damage you've really caused. Anyway... Um, I think it's a good thing. I don't think people should just be able to go around putting in windows and... I, I agree yeah. entirely. I mean, do you remember the sort of open season on statues after the Coulston statue came yeah. down? Yeah. Uh, I remember Abraham Lincoln was targeted. And Ch Winston he Churchill. Yeah. He did yeah, civil yeah. rights. Churchill got completely done. And actually, you can still see it if you look up close. It hasn't been scrubbed off entirely, all the graffiti. So, yeah, I think it's, it's, I mean, damaging public property is obviously not a good thing. Hmm. Um, and, you know, there are obviously times when statues being pulled down is a time to be celebrated. You think of Saddam Hussein's statue coming down. Hmm. Uh, but it should not be open season on anything you find you don't like um, in the public space. Yeah. Link, just linked to that on the subject of statues, as, as an aside, um, there was a... Uh, suggestion that the fourth plinth in Trafalgar Square should now house a statue of Queen Elizabeth II and um, Sadiq Khan's ruled that out. They ah. use that fourth plinth, don't they, for contemporary modern art and they've said, oh, we're going to keep it to do that rather than do the, the statue of, of the Queen.